Good morning to everyone present here. Today we are going to talk about computer graphics. In computer graphics, there are two types of display. The first one is an abstract scan display and the second one is a random scan display. Today we are going to talk about a raster scan display. So let's be move on to the slide. Okay, what do you mean by raster scan display? The raster scan display is the electron beam that passes through the entire screen area in a row from top to bottom. That means from left to top to the right bottom. So each and every row in a scan, each and every row as a pixels, we call it as a scan line. So in a scan line, the first pixel is noted as a left top and the last pixel is noted as a right bottom. So these are the pixels scanned by the electron beams and the electron beams are passed through the electron guns. So whenever the electron beams are passed through the electron guns, the scan line is getting elevated. So based on the scan line which we scan by the electron beams, or call it as a raster scan display. Then in raster scan display, there are so many components of that. The first component is a refresh buffer or a frame buffer. In refresh buffer or a frame buffer, the definition of a picture is stored in the area. And maybe it is also called as a memory area that we store the frames as well as a picture definition in the particular area. What do you mean by picture definition? So picture definition is nothing but the uh, width and height of the pixels, a uh, pictures, and the intensity and the resolution of the pictures, all those things which will be stored in the picture definition, and the picture definition is stored in some memory area, and that memory area is called as a refresh buffer or a frame buffer. And the second one is a pixel element. It is a small rectangular portion of the screen. The image which we shown in the slide, we mark as a pixel element or picture element. We call it as a pixel. So, pixel is a unit representation of an image. For example, we may represent distance with the help of kilometers, millimeters, centimeter, and may, we represent the time with the help of hours, minutes, and seconds, and we represent the image with the help of pixels. That is what we showed in the picture, that is what we shown in the image. Okay. Then the next one is a bitmap image. So, bitmap as well as pixmap. So, bitmap is used for black and white systems and pixmap is used for color monitors. In bitmap, we represent one pixel per bit and if it is a black and white screen, the black represents 0 and the white represents 1. And it, then the pixmap, a pixmap is for a single pixel, for an individual pixel, there are multiple bits are stored in the individual pixel that we call as pixmap. It will be used in color monitors. And the refresh rate of the access scan display is 60 to 80 frames per second. And the refresh rate are measured in heads. And the refresh rate per second is 60 to 80 frames. Okay, then the horizontal retrace as well as the vertical retrace. In horizontal retrace, the electron beams are starts from, already we talk about that electron beams are start from the left corner of the pixels and it ends with the right bottom of the pixel. That is what we call horizontal trace and in vertical trace it will be processing across the scan line and it will return back to the left top corner and it starts from the next frame. That is what we call a vertical retrace. So this is all over within a today class. Thank you all of you.